Welcome back to Let's Play Ocarina of Time. Alright, so let's move on now. We're going to the graveyard, because that's the, that's the place I forgot to mention. Well, I did remember it on the very end of the video last time, so we're going to go there right now. Because there's a song we got to get, and also uh, a, a shield we need to get, because um, the ha Halion shield... Instead of getting it to the market shop, because it's about um, 80 rubies, you can get it here for free. I'll show you where that is, though. But yeah, you have to actually go here in order to get one song that we need to get. It's really, really good to have in the game. It's also important. But we're going to move this. You see how it shows the flowers? You can also move this. Wait a minute. What? Oh, that's right, that's right, that's right. Hold on. We gotta get, um... Yeah, we get an upgrade a little bit later. That's right. Forgot about that. Well, not an upgrade, but it's a thing we gotta have. Alright, so you go over here, and then you have to... Hold on, I gotta press... I gotta pause the thing real quick. And then we gotta get our ocarina in order to play Zelda's Lullaby. Yeah, and then something crazy happens here. I find this pretty cool. Like, Navi's over there is like, I don't want to be a part of this. Yep, so we go down there. Alright, and here there is... There's gonna be these bats. These things are very, very annoying enemies. Alright, these are called... Keys. I think that's how you say it. But they're very annoying, but... No worries, we got this. But there's a couple of them around here. You can always log on. There's also on walls over here. All right, come on. When they fly around, they start to get real annoying to actually target. All right, we took care of that problem. Especially in the emulator, they'd be very, very annoying to get. And here's also another thing. Uh. You see how Navi's green? It's like she's trying to show you something, but uh, we need to uh, go ahead and get this song that we need to get, and then I'll play this song, and I think we get a heart piece. I don't really remember. Like I said, I'm not going to 100% this game. And we're coming up on the most frightening enemies in the entire game. These enemies are called the Redeads. Listen to this. Yeah. When I was a kid, man, I was frightened by these guys. Just walk past them. Don't even bother. Yeah, and that happens. That always gets me. <laughs> that screaming happens. They freeze you, and you have to like try to move out. But yeah. All right. So we come up on our song here. We go to check. This song is called the Sun Song, and this is actually very good to have because you can make it day or night time anytime you want to. In case if you want to get golden sculptures a lot faster, you can just like if it's daytime you can play at night. So this is called the Sun Song. All right. Oh crap! Yeah, that's right. I'm I accidentally pressed the A button. <laughs> Just remember, this is the emulator version, so it's a little bit... The buttons are a little bit weird. So now it turns nighttime. time. 
And also, here's another good thing. Those redeads, you can actually freeze them by playing the song as well. So it's a big plus, actually. So you can just, like, walk past them. But if you try to attack them, it takes eight hits to kill those guys. With uh, Link's uh, Kokiri, Kokiri sword. So now we can play it again. Whoops. So now you'll hear a sound, and that means they're frozen. There we go. Now we can just walk past them. This only happens a short amount of time. It does last a, a little while. But yeah, we're going to ignore them because I don't want to bother to fight them. Alright, so let's try to play something over here that... Alright, let's see if this works. I think it's Zelda's Lullaby or this one. I think it's this one. Yeah, it is. A treasure chest. No, it's not a treasure. What, what the hell is this? Oh. I didn't even look like a, f a fairy. Okay. I guess that was kind of a waste of time, but... It, that's actually good to have. Those fairies actually give you full health automatically. Yeah, it's night time here. Alright, so... I don't think we can move these yet because we don't have a certain item that we have yet, so I don't think I can get my shield just quite yet. I do want to try one more time though and see what happens. We also have this graveyard guy over here. Whoops, I did not mean to use that. Oh, we can move it, okay. Yeah, we couldn't do it before, but yeah. Alright, go down here. I think this is where we get it. Alright, let me just hope I'm right here. Yep. Halion Shield. Yeah, this is the better way to get it. So instead of spending 80... Oh yeah, we also bombed this, but we don't have uh, any bombs yet. So we're going to try to go back there later. I think that's where the Fairy Fountain is. I don't really remember. It's been a long time since I played this game. It hasn't been too long, but... I'm only going to show you um, certain plays, but also you can get a heart piece with this guy. But um, let me see if I can do it. Hold on. We have to get really lucky to actually do this, though. So. Don't be. I think it's don't be the great great keeper. I never really bothered to say his real name. I just call him the graveyard guy. But you do get a heart piece here. He'll start digging around, but you have to spend 10 rubies every single time you talk to him. So I want to see if I can get this. This is probably going to be pure luck. No. Yeah, there's a certain spot. You have to make a move. But I don't want to really waste my too much of my time on this, though. So. But yeah, you do get a heart piece. I'll probably get it later. Because he moves very, very slow. So, so yeah, we're going to go ahead and leave here. And we're going to get a couple... We're gonna we're gonna get a couple of golden sculptures. Let's get them out of the way. Cause uh, like I said, golden sculptures only come out during nighttime. Certain of the time, usually outside though. And those cuckoos, I'm gonna get those later, cause they take way too much time. So I might do that maybe um, a filler episode probably. So I'm gonna try to find golden sculptures right now. And I hear one right now. I think there's one up here. Yeah, there is. So, let's take care of one of them. So, when you have ten golden sculptures, you go back to that golden sculpture house, and there'll be a guy uncursed. So, I, I was wrong about saying there's ten of them in there, but there's actually five total. So, there's going to be another one over here, too. The reason why I'm doing this so I can get... Well, you don't have to hit all of them, so... Okay, so what we have to do is roll this. And then another one pop out. Right in front of us. Ow. Alright. We're not done yet. There's still a couple more. No, there's not one in there, actually. That's where one of the cuckoos are. Alright, there's one up here in this ladder, actually. Yeah, there's a big ladder up here. 
and uh, it does look. Yeah, this one right up there. Alright, I'm going to climb up this, of course. Of course, I'm going to get hurt when I go down, but I, I don't care. There's there's uh, pots up over there, so we're just going to re-heal ourselves. Alright, get off. Yeah. So, yeah, we're good. Okay, I think there's one more. I could be wrong, though, because uh, there's a lot of them here. Yeah, there is. Alright. That's about like four of them over here. Yeah, a couple of these places, um, this place is a shop. I think it turns, no, it turns into a shop. Never mind. That's a little bit, that's a little bit later in the game. Alright, hold on, let me think of something real quick. I think there's another place I forgot to go. Okay, hold on a second. Yeah, let me go up here real quick. Oh yeah, there is one. I knew it was missing one of them. Yeah, there's a lot of them here. Alright. That's like five of them here, man. Okay, we go up here. Wow, I didn't even, I forgot there was a guard up here. Alright, I think that's all the golden sculpture is here. Because I did search quite a bit already. I think I am probably missing one, one more though, but it's like in the roof so okay we're gonna go over here real quick we're gonna leave this town and then um before we head to the death mountain i'm not gonna really cut this though i just want to show you where the place is all right oh yeah and we also have these guys that come out during night time only but what I'm going to do, I'm going to turn in daylight so these guys won't bother us. And uh, there you go, it's daytime already. And also the bridge over there, if you climb up that um, chain, you'll get 20 rubies off there. If you keep going up, so we're going to do the quick way. But we're going. We're actually going to go um, to Long Long Ranch. There's another song we need to get, and a couple, maybe a couple of heart pieces in here and there. So, I'm going to get as much items as I can. Like I said, I'm not 100%ing this game. So yeah. All right. Well, that was quick. Because instead of like rolling, 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 it'll just take too, way too long. It'd be so annoying. Alright. Long, long ranch. There's another important song that we need to get. Just to get out of the way. But I'm going to take care of something really, really fast. And hopefully this I do successful in this. Because this part gets really annoying. And look who it is. It's Talon. Yeah, this is a little mini game actually. You get, uh, you get milk here, but I decided to show you it. Super cuckoos. He's actually gonna be throwing um, three cuckoos, and you have to find exactly where they are. That's why there's a whole bunch of them around here. Yeah. All right, let's do it. So I know the first one is. Get over here. Nope. Yeah, this gets really annoying. Oh damn it! That last one's always really hard to find because there's 
It's all cramped up together. Come on. Finally. I thought I was never ever going to find that. That was pure luck. Oh, jeez. The good thing is, you only do this once. I'm probably going to cut out the first part because I failed miser miserably. Maybe I'll just show you where how I failed and then I'll just cut to the part I actually got it. Yeah. Yep, long long milk. So now we got our empty our our empty body bottle. Oh my god, I can't talk. Jeez. Alright, now when you press pause. We have our first empty bottle. Well, it's not empty right now, but we have our bottle. And the second empty bottle is actually the uh, catching all the cuckoos and uh yeah. And also there is a golden sculpture um if you play the sun song here in Long Long Ranch, you there's a couple here, but uh first we're going to get our song. Kakariko Village. Yeah, that yeah. I knew that the town was called, but it just Whatever. So here she is again. <laughs> Ipona. Yep. Talk to her again. All right, hold on a minute. Mhm. Mm yeah, you touched her three times. Okay. Now we play something. This is Epona's song. Now, when you play this song, Epona will follow you. Not just that, but also it can attract other animals, like cows and stuff. And look who it is. You have to put, put him in a little scenery as well, I guess. So now he probably like a, likes us, but sadly we can't ride a Puna in this, uh, in this age. It's actually later in the game, actually. See, now she's following us. Alright, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to make it night time. Now it's night. But the pro okay, now there's one problem. I can't really get this sculpture yet because we don't have a certain item to actually reach it. Yes, there is um, enemies here as well. But we're going to get a couple of these and get them out of the way. Yeah, there's one right up there in the window. We can't get that yet because it's, we don't have the item that we need. There's one in this tree right here. Okay. Stay away from me. Well, it's always good to have those, though. All right. And right, now we got cows everywhere. Now here's a funny thing: when you play a point of song, for some reason these cows make random noises, which is actually pretty creepy. So we're gonna move these. No, get down there. Okay. Yep, 
and you go over here. Hold on. Hold on, let me let me. What the hell? That was a weird glitch. Yeah, we have to move this just a little bit so we can get through here. Come on, go in there. And there's our heart piece. It's always nice to actually get those. Alright, let's get out of here. No, don't grab. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and leave. I'm going to make it daytime because I can. I don't know why, I just feel like it. Okay. Alright, well, I'm going to finally stop the video. Wow, I'm just going like 23 minutes already. Jeez, I'm definitely going to be cutting out some parts. Maybe I'll cut out some parts to get all the way over here or whatever, or I don't know. But probably, I'm definitely going to cut out that mini game that where I failed and stuff like that. But I'm probably going to be cutting out a few parts here and there. Not just not the stuff where I need to show you where to go, but yeah. But what I'm going to do, I'm going to go back to uh, Kakariko Village to do the uh, side... Kuko's thing. Just get that. Definitely get that out of the way in the next video, just so I won't think about it anymore. Alright, guys, this has been Suzaku7. Sign out. I'll catch you guys later. Peace out.